Hello guys, what's up? Welcome back to another Roblox video. Now, shout out to Dark Being for sending me this over on Discord. Pretty much in today's video, guys, we're going to be checking out Roblox's new AI assistant. Now, I just want to say this has got nothing to do with the Roblox Studio AI. That is also a thing, and you can use that to pretty much build your Roblox games. You can make models, textures, things like that. However, this one is something different. It kind of tells you about the Roblox website rather than like building your own games inside of Roblox Studio. So I thought that was kind of cool and uh, yeah we're gonna check it out we're gonna ask it a few questions and we're basically gonna see if it's any good i don't know about you guys but personally i kind of like ai i don't really know how to feel about it to be honest because of course i like people making art i like people being creative and it does seem a shame that with ai it's so easy to just generate in custom images and stuff as i was saying in one of my videos like a few months ago if i ever need some random texture or an image like a picture of a spider or something i got one of those the other day i can just generate it using like like the Dali Mini and it's just so easy. Anyway, here we are on the Roblox Creator Hub. If you guys want to go to this and try this out for yourself, um, I'll link it down below. It's called create.roblox.com slash doc slash assistant. And pretty much, um, yeah, here we are, Roblox's new AI assistant. So if you're not signed in on the Creator Hub, I mean, you should be, you can just go and sign in there. And let's see, include detailed context and examples in your questions to get the best response from our AI assistant. There is a guide there. I guess we can try some stuff first though. Ask a question and start creating in studio. Okay. So I guess it's still interlinked a bit, but this time it's different because like I was saying, it's not just models. So you can build, you can grow your game and you can also monetize your game to make Robux and real money. Yeah, what should I ask it? Shall I say, how do I keep my Robux account safe? That might be a good one. There you go. I think that's a good question. Hi, Sharkbox. Before I reply, please accept. Oh, okay. Of course, you've got to accept the terms of use. To keep your Robux account safe, there are a few important tips. Oh, wow. It genuinely told me what to do. Yeah, so use a strong password, two steps. Yep. Be cautious of your personal information, mindful of scams. Yeah, that's fair enough. That's pretty good. I'll leave a like on that. No, I don't want to submit feedback though. That's annoying. Okay, so far, that's a bit better than I expected. Shall I ask it a bit more of a random question? What should I spend my Robux on? That's a good question. I might actually buy something if it tells me. If it tells me like a Dominus or something, I'm not buying that. Oh, here you go. Some good options. Customize your avatar. Support your favorite developers. Upgrade your games. Yeah, fair enough. Not bad at all. Now that it's Let's get some other random question. Um, what is the rarest Roblox accessory? I feel like that's a bit of a random question. It might struggle with this one, but you know, we can try. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, not bad. Dominus Empress. I would say that's probably one of the rarest. I mean, to be fair, there probably are like random gift card items of like four owners. Also antlers. Um, I don't think that's particularly rare, like a Jared Valdez item, right? Roblox classic fedora. That's not too rare either. The Valkyrie Valky. What the heck is that? Oh, it's a Beyblade. Oh, I see. That's pretty cool. Bro, I used to love Beyblades. A funny story, right? When I was at school, my dad made me a custom one because my Beyblade broke like it snapped in half. And you know, you had those like little, oh, what do you call them? Just like the little um, pin bit at the bottom where, you know, it'd spin around on like the spinning top part, right? So my dad put like a real screw in there. So when I'd spin it on like a wooden table, it'd like drill itself into the table. That thing was mental. That was like a Beyblade menace. And now I'm just joking. I know it doesn't actually mean Beyblades, but but yeah, kind of funny. Shall I ask a bit more of a random question? Shall I say who is Sharkblocks? I'm going to put my channel name in first. If it doesn't come up with anything, I'll try my like Roblox name. Oh my God, it got it. Are you serious? Sharkblocks is a popular Roblox YouTuber. Well, I wouldn't say that. I kind of fell off. He's also known for creating videos that cover a wide range of topics to Roblox, including games, reviews, tutorials, updates, and discussions. Wow, I'm really surprised. I wonder what this uses. It must use like chat GPT tea in a way or something. Maybe I should ask it something that's just not about Roblox at all. My PC won't turn on. I'm curious to see if it answers random stuff and not just, you know, Roblox related. Oh, here you go. We stumped it. I'm sorry to hear that you're having trouble with your PC. However, as a Roblox assistant, I can only provide guidance on how to build grind Roblox stuff. Yeah, we get the idea. It would be best to consult with a computer technician or refer to relevant technical resources. There you go. At least it knew what I was on about. I mean, yeah, to be fair, Roblox have got to be a bit careful here because if people were asking it inappropriate stuff, considering Roblox is like a kid safe website, right? They could get in trouble over that. Let's ask it a bit of like a controversial question, like Roblox wise anyway. How can I get unbanned on Roblox? I think that's a pretty good question because it might genuinely just say you can't or it might give you some tips. If you've been banned on Roblox, there are a few steps you can try to get unbanned. Understand the reason, contact the support. Yeah, that's fair enough. I mean, to be fair, that's mostly what I say to you guys. Sometimes I get questions as 
especially on Instagram and they're from you guys and they're saying show up blocks I really want to get on banned some of you guys think I can just like send your profile to the admins and they're on ban it but honestly that's not how it works I wish I could honestly I really wish I do but even if I was banned myself there's like not much I can do except for try the same thing as you guys you know try this sort of thing I really want to try this right who is the oh, what should I say least popular Roblox player I actually don't know who it would be maybe people like fave and stuff or um like uh, nafrix or something let's just see what it says maybe it's too negative though yeah that's the thing it couldn't really say that i guess i tell you what we could ask though um who is ro wait is it just fave who is fave i don't know if he was called robux fave was he oh they don't have information they knew who shark blocks was but they don't know who fave is what about that nafrix guy nafrix i'm just trying to think of people that sort of you know got exposed and lost their roblox careers or oh, it doesn't know who is kilo gish okay come on if it actually answers that that's gonna be funny uh, <laughs> there you go he has a youtube channel where he shares gameplay well he did have a youtube channel and he used to have a large following wow that's kind of funny actually i wonder if it's because kellogish was in the stars program that might be why why is creek craft such a nerd that's a pretty good question i have been wondering that for quite a while i have even asked him and he just wouldn't tell me so yeah roblox don't know yeah creek craft's well respected i'm only joking guys let's just try a few more because otherwise this video is going to be way too long um what limited should i buy i think that's a pretty good question i don't think it's going to tell me or it might just list out some which are pretty cool oh more details about your preferences budget okay that's better than i expected i have 1000 robux what's limited should i buy yeah okay i'm actually gonna buy it if it recommends me something i will buy it but it's got to be good with a budget of a thousand robux you can get limited hat oh, well i know i'm asking for which one i don't even think it said a name there did it yeah it just says explore um name a cool limited worth 1000 robux there you go name a cool limited worth a thousand robux it must be able to tell me one thing dominus empress yeah i wish it was a thousand robux well i guess it is if you want the ugc knockoff it probably costs what like 200 or 150 or something okay one last question when is public ugc coming out there you go that's a good question when is public ugc coming come on you've got to let us know you've got to give us the roblox secrets okay public user generated content has already been released what no it hasn't well that was helpful wasn't it oh and i just want to say you guys you can ask it scripting questions so like uh how do i make a kill brick script in studio yeah let's try that um i just kept this video for like random questions really because um the roblox studio thing's been a thing since december i think but yeah this will tell you as well so um it's just more in depth i guess it will give you like scripting and um you can just copy and paste it in very very useful um maybe i'll do another video on the studio version i'll try and build a game out of it or something only something basic but you can see this would be perfect for obbies and things like that so honestly guys for my like full review on this thing i'd give that easily like an 8 out of 10 it's very very useful the only thing i would say if you know a lot about roblox you probably won't really need to ever use it if you wanted like a script for your game like a music script or a kill brick script or something random like that definitely try this it might not be like 100 percent accurate every single time but it's definitely better than nothing and um yeah i thought that was actually Actually quite cool. I'm definitely more impressed with it than I expected it to be. When I saw Roblox had like an AI assistant thing, I thought, oh, this thing's going to be useless. But no, not too bad.